Hello, my name is Alejandra Vargas Garcia and I'm a program officer for knowledge translation for the GROW program at IDRC. So the GROW program launched one year ago and we were interested in two things. One is that we wanted to get research that was high quality evidence and incredibly relevant and the other element was really thinking about research that could influence and inform policies and programs. And the reason why this matters is because when you think of the complexities of women's economic empowerment nowadays, I think it'd be a huge disservice to the potential of the research that our grantees are generating not to really find outlets where it can be shared and disseminated in ways that are interested, really connect with the movers and shakers that can do something tangible with it. So with this in mind, the GROW program has developed a research uptake strategy. And at the core of it, I think what research uptake means is really kind of getting the right information to the right people at the right time. And what we mean by that is getting the right information really means generating information that's clear, that's concise, that kind of keeps the end user in mind. Um, and then I think getting it at the right time means trying to find kind of what are the policy windows of opportunities to make sure that you can tap your research into what's happening in the field more concretely. And then when you think about communication products, you really generate them in a way that not only addresses kind of the bigger questions in policy briefs and working papers, but also kind of find opportunities to communicate in more active and kind of engaging ways as well. And social media is a good example of that. How do you tap into a network on a real time basis? So I think we're going to be focusing our research uptake strategy on four interconnected kind of strands. The first one has to do with stakeholder engagement. And what we're asking grantees to think about is really to kind of do a stakeholder mapping on who it is they want to engage with throughout the life of their projects, why, and kind of what are the avenues to reach those connections. The second element has to do with communications. What are the traditional and non-traditional communication strategies that they're going to use to make sure that they can generate results in a way that are going to be read by the audience that they kind of want to make sure that they take them with them home and read them and then kind of talk about the implications of implementing that into their work. The third element has to do with capacity building. GROW is in an interesting position because it's bringing together organizations from north and south and asking them kind of to work together in research. And I think this presents a wonderful opportunity to really think about what partnerships mean in the research context and really find opportunities and added value that each organization brings into the table and develop that throughout the life of the project. And the last element is the monitoring and evaluation of uptake. Really kind of working with grantees to have them develop indicators so they can measure how successful they are in taking policy into action. And we are very sensitive to the fact that every project is different, that context matters, and that there isn't a one-size-fits-all approach. So we're really working on a very targeted strategy where each project can develop indicators that really suit their needs. I'm really excited about the research uptake strategy. We'll be sharing more information on the website, and I really hope that you'll get an opportunity to read more about our plans and the fantastic work of our 11 grantees and the next steps for GROW.